Hi guys, time to diss the girls! So we all know girls that do some really annoying things that really piss us off. Things that annoy me about girls. Hi guys, I did a video on what annoy me about guys. It's only fair that I do the same for the girls. I'm so sorry if this upsets you, but I'm talking typical girls, generic girls, not every single girl, because obviously everyone's different. Lush. You know the shop, Lush, they do soaps, they do um, smelly bars, they do creams. Lush, and it's in the name, it's Lush, but it's not. It's vile, Lush is disgusting. I can't bear Lush products. I walk past the shop and it makes me I don't know why, I've just always been like this and I've got friends who wear Lush products or have Lush baths and Lush showers. They all know that Lush is not one of my things. It's just like, it's such a distinctive smell, but it's it's so pungent. Pungent. It goes right on my nose, it hits my brain, and it makes me go <gasps> Why? Why are you so in love with Lush stuff? Almost every girl that I know is like, oh my god, I love Lush, I love what I love what they've got, and I love having a Lush bath, I love my Lush shower stuff, and oh my god, the hair, the hair cream from Lush is just amazing. It stinks, and that really annoys me when I smell it. So it might not be the girl that's annoying me. It's just the lush and the girl thing put together. Another thing that I see an awful lot of girls do is pyjamas in public. And there should be a law against wearing pyjamas in public. I saw um, a mother walking down the street holding her two children's hands. She had a full kit out, pyjama bottoms, pyjama top, a wardrobe, a wardrobe on. She was wearing a wardrobe! She had a dressing gown on and big slippers. Just picked her kids up from school. It just makes you look lazy. It makes you look like you can't be arsed and it just makes you look quite trampy. I think it's trampy. And I was in a chip shop and there was this, there was a couple, really fit couple, like they were really pretty. The guy was, he had a shirt on and he, nice jeans, nice boots. To, he was completely kitted out. And his girlfriend who was next to him, really pretty girl, so pretty. But she had her pajamas on. She had these big slippers, she was wearing pajama bottoms, pajama top. And I was just like, your boyfriend has made such an effort like he obviously takes good care of himself and he obviously cares about how he looks when he's out in public and then you're stood next to him looking like a tramp. Don't do it girls. Girls also have double standards. I hear when girls go on dates and they're like, oh he didn't open the door for me, he didn't pay for the bill, he didn't do this, he didn't do that. He wasn't much of a gentleman. I just don't understand why he wouldn't do all those things. But then, I want to be classed as a modern woman. I want to be independent. I don't like always being asked where I am. I don't like having the image of me having to stay at home and be a housewife and do dishes. You double standards. Sorry. You can't expect to be a modern independent woman and then on the other side of the card ask the guys to be old fashioned and live back in the 1950s. I'm sorry, I just think you're completely wrong. If you want to be that independent, open your own bloody door, do your own dishes, cook your dinners. Sorry, that's just how I feel. And the typical girl always complains about being fat. She's always like, oh, I, th I feel fat in this. Do I look fat in this? Oh, you don't hear guys complaining about being fat. If a guy's fat, he makes a joke about it. Oh, guess we ate all the pies today. It was me. They don't sit at home crying about being fat while they're eating a huge chunk of dairy milk and a cup of hot chocolate. Stop complaining about it. If you've got Complain about it. Don't sit there and drown your sorrows in a cup of hot chocolate. Go on a diet. Eat properly. Go to the gym. Just don't complain about being fat when most of you are not fat. You might have a bit of a, bit of a curve on you, but that doesn't make you fat. Don't complain about it. And nine times out of ten, if you think you're fat, and that's not a good excuse for you guys to become anorexic or bulimic, but if you think you're fat, if you think you're too big, then chances are you probably are bigger than you should be. Don't complain about it. Do something about it. Be a bit more relaxed about your size. If you want to feel comfortable, you need to accept who you are. And typical girls will wear flat shoes or fake Ugg boots. Why? Do you know what I think looks really nice on a girl? Legs. Girls' legs. I love girls' legs. And I might be gay, but I don't get turned on by girls' legs. Every single pair of girls' legs that I see with a set of heels, spot on. Nobody's legs can look bad in heels. And I said this to somebody earlier today, if I was a girl, I'd have heels on all the time. Even my, my, you know those slippers with heels on them? I'd have slipper heels. I just, I think legs always look fantastic in a set of heels. Girls know that I feel this way. Girls that I know, know how I feel about flat shoes. Flat shoes seem to make girls hunch a bit. They seem to just make their legs look stumpy. It makes you walk a bit funny. Like, I just feel like you should wear heels all the time. If I was a girl, I'd probably feel differently. That's just kind of one of my annoyances. I don't like flat shoes or Ugg. Mainly with the Ugg boots, because no one 
can wear them properly, they just fold under your feet and then like you end up walking funny, like you've got a bapit leg or something. Those are my annoyances for now. Those are just a few. If you've got an annoyance with girls, give me a thumbs up. If you want to tell me what they are, drop me a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe for more videos in the future. I will speak to you soon guys, take care, bye bye. POW! Yeah, I know exactly what you mean, you're like, you've not heard a single word I've said and you might even have the same conversation two or three times because they just cannot listen. I'm guilty of it myself because believe it or not, I'm a guy, yeah, believe it or not.